This video demonstrates what comes with the Fright Props Double Acting Hookup Kit. The Double Acting Hookup Kit is for use with a double acting cylinder. Double acting cylinder has air that goes into the bottom and the top. Our Double Acting Hookup Kit comes with 20 feet of airline, two 90 degree elbow fittings for the cylinder, and your choice of a Mac brand four-way valve or an STC brand four-way five-ported valve. You also have the choice of what size threads to get on your fittings. There's quarter inch and there's eighth inch. The selection depends on your cylinder port size. The cylinder I'm using here is a three-quarter inch bore. Bore is how big the capacity is inside of the cylinder. And the three-quarter inch bore uses eighth-inch threaded fittings. When you buy a solenoid alone, it comes with no fittings and open ports. The kit gives you a quick connect that's going to go to the compressor air source an exhaust or debris muffler and fittings to go out to the cylinder. I'm going to hook up our cylinder using some quarter inch airline that comes with the kit and you can cut this with anything. I'm using one of our tubing cutters here. but you So a piece of airline goes into one of the fittings going out of the solenoid and the other one to the other port going out. And those two go to the cylinder. I've cut them real short, but the kit comes with 20 feet of airline, so you can make it any size you want. Now the quick connect goes to your barrel connector from your compressor. When the solenoid's not plugged in, it pushes air from the compressor out the port and into the top of the cylinder, which pushes the shaft back. When you energize the solenoid, air is going to push to the bottom, pushing the shaft out with air, and the displaced air that's being pushed in front of the piston is going to come back down this air line and come out of the exhaust. Then when we turn it off or de-energize the solenoid, air is going to push through the top again, pushing this shaft back, moving air back out through this air line and out through the same exhaust. By activating the solenoid rapidly, you can make it go in and out. The STC 5-ported 4-way valve operates in much of the same way. It pushes air to the top of the cylinder, pushing it back. When energized, it pushes air to the bottom, making the shaft come out, displacing air through the line and through exhaust A. When it's de-energized, it pushes air through the top of the cylinder, pushes it back, pushes displaced air back down the line and through the other exhaust. Both of these four-way valves are available in either 110 volt, 12 volt, or 24 volt. If you select the 110 version, you can use a standard power plug connected to the two wires on the solenoid. When this is plugged into an outlet, it'll energize the valve. If you select 12 or 24 volt, you need to use a power pack or transformer to go to the wires on the valve. And the same when this is energized, it will energize the valve. Selecting the proper power supply depends on your application. And if using a controller, refer to the controller's manual to know which is best for you.